Hi everybody, uh, back for another update, it's been a little while. Um, just letting you know what's going on with my system, I'm having an issue with my nitrites and I think it's causing my fish some issues because I've had a few deaths. So uh, maybe you guys can help me out with some comments later on, but let's continue with this update. So everything's doing pretty well over here, this right here was one of my mango seeds, I put it in there and it seems to be doing pretty well. Checking it out, it's growing. Uh, my tomato plants are over here. They're doing really well before. They're about this tall, and they've uh, about doubled in size in a week. Um, right here, sorry about that. I think I got a flower starting to form already. Oops, sorry, right there. It's a little hard to see. But uh, yeah, I believe that's a flower. I got more flowers down here on my pepper plant because they got some new shoots down here which was kind of cool and I got some more up at the top there they are but uh, I've heard harvested about 10 11 peppers off of that whole thing and I still got a bunch more on there so I'm happy with that everything seems to be growing well the lettuce is getting thicker I don't know what I'm gonna do if it all starts growing really big it's gonna be so thick it's gonna be crazy my uh, my seeds are starting to grow some roots now, finally, for my avocado pits. Oops. And then down here to my fish, they seem to be doing okay, but I've been having some problems. If you look at them, if you can see them closely, some of the scales on the fish are falling off. There's one. And I think that's because they're sick, because... Uh, since I've uh, changed the fitting over here on the on the water out that because since I changed it it's not leaking anymore and I'm not having to add as much water as I was before and since uh, I was adding water before I was stunting the cycling of the whole system here and now that I don't have to add water as often I think it's starting to uh, properly cycle and I'm getting a nitrite build up. Here's my nitrites. There you go. And so I'm having to fight that. I got some salt and I added it to my system. And the fish are okay, but um, my goldfish aren't doing so well. And I think it's because the nitrites and hopefully they don't have brown blood because if they do, it causes lack of oxygen in the bloodstream and they basically suffocate from what I've read and what I've been told. Now the salt is supposed to help with that by um, blocking the nitrites from getting into their system through their gills when they take in oxygen. So I've been adding some salt and everything seems to be doing okay. I haven't had any plants die or turn yellow. So that's a good sign. Because I've been using uh, aquarium salt from my uh, local store at PetSmart. But uh, all my other readings are seem, seem to be doing pretty well. Here's my nitrates. I've actually got a decent reading on them. There we go. And then my ammonia isn't so bad. It's about a 0.25. And then my pH is about a 6.4 to a 6.6. .6 which I'm happy about because the pH is about where it's supposed to be they say having it between 7 and 6.4 is a good range for uh, growing your plants and it's not too acidic but uh, other than that I mean everything's doing okay I added some worms to the grow bed and they're probably not going to do so hot but I was able to find some duckweed at, my, uh, at one of my other pet stores in my neighborhood and they don't like it because it grows like a weed in their fish tanks when they get their plants in. So they gave it to me for free. You can see some of it right there. I didn't get a whole lot because they didn't have a whole lot. But it was free. So if it takes off, it takes off. And I'll be happy about that because not much light get, comes down here. And I know they need light. So we'll see how it works out. Because I didn't want to stick it right on the top over here. Just for whatever reason, I didn't want to clog up the system or take over but we'll see how it works if anything 
I'll just uh, grow some on the side because I have a little shelf right there. But everything seems to be doing pretty well. I'm happy about it. So if you guys have any comments or any helpful suggestions about uh, helping my system with my uh, fish, I'd be greatly appreciated. I mean, I've added, I've done a couple water changes, so I'm trying to fight it that way. I've added the salt, uh, so all I can do is hope for the best and expect the worst. But uh, thanks for you guys' help. If you guys leave anything, and if not, you guys have a great day, anyways. All right, take care. Bye.